Whereas in Hong Kong, we should expect more intense negative spillovers if the US-China disputes were to continue, or if the global economy were to continue to lose its momentum. And any bless one effect might also can always take us by surprise. Another concern is that when the next financial crisis hits, or if a global recession arrives, central banks will have very little ammunition left to stimulate the economies. The banking sector will face more rapid technological transformation. There are, of course, opportunities, but there are also challenges associated with this.